Alrighty, hello guys, welcome your faces back to another video on my channel. Today we are going to be continuing on with our aircraft carrier, and as you guys can see in the previous video, uh, we actually ended up adding a bunch of lights to the front. We also did some other stuff as well that I can't really remember right now. Uh, but anyway, what I wanted to do today was actually add a crane, uh, or maybe even about three cranes, that can move things around within the hangar. Now you might be thinking, well... Uh, you, you don't need that, but um, I think we do. I think it would be a, a good addition to this. So we're going to do a crane that goes from like here to probably around here. Uh, maybe even just there. And then a crane from goes, goes from here to probably like halfway along here. And then a crane from probably here to all the way at the end. Uh, and what that will allow us to do is actually pick up things, move them along, and put them down somewhere else in case we need to do that. I'm not entirely sure we will ever need to do that, but in case we do, we'll have one. So, let's just go ahead and build it, put it in, and see what happens. Hey! Okie dokie, so we need to try and figure out how we actually want this to work, and uh, just go for it. So, I'm actually going to go ahead and place these in uh, just below where the lights are, of course, because uh, that's how it's supposed to work. Anyway, track. So, it's going to be kind of interesting how this does work. We're essentially going to have to put some tracks on here. Um, I'm going to make them this dark grey colour, and we're going to have to figure out where they're going to have to go. I do think... Uh, so, they can't actually go there. Alright, that's not allowed, because if we do this, you see? Uh, so, it'll actually have to go on this wall. This will be the centre, and we will go from there. We'll make it this colour for now, uh, and we will do this. So, that essentially has to go on there like so. Uh, we'll actually bring it out one, and we will attach it to the wall eventually, but that's okay. It essentially has to go all the way to the end, <laughs> which is kind of crazy, but yes, it does have to go all the way to the end. Uh, and realistically, I should be building this on both sides. So let's go ahead and do that, and replace this with this one. Send it all the way back down to that end, and continue with it. Let's go! Let's go, let's go, let's go! So this goes literally all the way into this wall. Uh, we will be deleting this, and this, and this, and this, and all of this too. There we go, excellent, uh, including that one, and we'll go ahead and put this piece directly into there like that. So essentially what this allows us to do is have something moving up and down the middle of the uh, the hangar, um, and then we'll build something that allows it to go left and right on that rail, and then we'll have a winch on that bit that allows us to pick things up and move them along, which I think is a good idea. So we're going to continue with it, but now we need to figure out where we need to stop things. So I'm thinking we stop things about here. Uh, actually, probably like here instead, in line with that. Oh, that's a bit of a problem. That is a huge problem. So we can't actually have one there unless we go through this. And realistically, I mean, we can do that. We delete this from here, and we'd have to put it onto there instead, which is actually fine. We can get away with that, uh, and then do it to maybe about maybe about here. So we'll actually go from this point back to there. Excellent. And then we should be able to go from here. All the way across. However, however, we wouldn't really want to do that because it gets in the way of everything, doesn't it? It does. So it would actually have to come out a lot more than that, uh, which is not necessarily something I want to do. Oh, that's super annoying. Maybe we can just have one on this side and then one on that side, and that'll be good. I'm not sure that is good, though. I'm not, I'm not entirely pleased with that. Uh, delete this. Go ahead and put it back in there like so. Excellent. We're going to actually go to the other end. And we're going to delete from here, all the way across to, I believe, about there. Yeah, because that's in line with that one pretty much, is it? I think it is. Uh, there, there we go. Excellent. Uh, and I guess we'll just barrier this off from here. I think that's probably going to be fine. So, attach this to there. Attach that to there. Excellent. We're then going to attach this to the wall with one of these. Excellente. And we're also just going to attach it to the wall with one of those. Yeah. Okay, that works. We're going to have to do the same thing over here, which is fine. Uh, kind of. <laughs> it's fine, kind of. It is not fine, because it doesn't actually fit over there. Um, yeah, because the end of this one is actually, like, against this. So that's going to stay as it is. Uh, and that's okay. And then we'll just do this onto there. Uh, and that'll be fine, yeah. So it's as if it's supported. I think that works. So I'll have a crane on this side. I'll have a crane on that side. And that'll be okay. I did want it to go all the way along, but then I forgot we had the other elevator. So it doesn't really work. But that's okay, I think. Alright, so with that being said, we're going to go to around the middle. We're going to go ahead and delete that piece. We're going to go ahead and smack in one of these guys right here. 
And it doesn't really matter which way around it is. We're just going to do this. Excellent. Uh, we're then going to go to this side of here. Do do do. And we're going to do this all the way along here. There we go. Excellent. We go to the middle of that. Delete this piece. We're going to grab one of these, obviously. Uh, wait, actually. It didn't grab it, but never mind. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and put this piece directly into here like this. And actually, I think we'll do it the other way around. So we'll actually have it this way around. That's fine. Uh, oh, no, we can't. <laughs> what am I talking about? It has to go on this side. So, yeah, we'll have this go... Which way around is it? That way, like that. Excellent. Uh, we'll build this out so it knows it's got a... Um, uh, a winch on it, let's say. And we'll just build this in. Hopefully, it'll look good that way. And hopefully, it'll look good that way. And then we can add the winch directly in the center. And... That's it. There we go. That should work, essentially. That should sort of work. Now, with that being said, um, I think we're going to use my goals on it because we need it to be dangling down straight away. Otherwise, it's going to be really difficult to actually use. Uh, or, with that being said, actually, I've got an idea. So, build this into here. Excellent. It makes it a new part. We're going to bring this out to where it should be. So, bring it out to there. Bring it upwards a little bit. There we go. Get ourselves a rope anchor, and we should be able to just attach this directly up to there. Then delete these guys on the bottom, and we'll have another rope anchor right here uh, that we'll attach to the rest of it. So all we need to do is attach the rope to the rope. There we go. And that's it. So now this thing, in theory, should actually work. We're going to delete this one as well, because clearly we don't need it. And we'll see if it works. Let's get ourselves some throttle levers, and we'll go for it. So we need a left and right one, and then we need an up and a down one. Yep, and then we need some buttons to actually control the uh, thing. So that one and that one. Excellent. Right, okay, good. So these clearly aren't going to stay in the middle, but that's okay. So, oh wait, it's not even buttons, is it? It's, um, no, not buttons. That's not what I meant. It's not actually these that we need. It is actually buttons uh, in order to do all of it. So we need push buttons um, to do all of this, actually, except, right, hold on. So that and that will be for uh, lowering and raising, because they're toggle buttons. And then the push buttons uh, we'll use for the other stuff. So a uh, push button for left and right. There we go. And then a push button for... Um, uh, how am I going to do this? Uh, for this way and this way. There we go. I think that works. So we're going to attach this to whatever on here, like down. And this one on down. Excellent. This one's then going to be up. There we go. And there we go. We're going to have to put these in properly eventually, but that's okay. We're just checking if these work. Uh, this is going to be for, like, winch up. This is going to be for winch down. That's okay. This is going to be for left and right. Let's do it. So that one and this one. And all we've got to do is make sure all of these do actually work. Uh, and that's it. So let's go ahead and spawn this in. See if it works. And then we'll keep it, probably. Kind of interested to see whether this makes us lag out more or uh, or not. Because it, it could be really bad for us actually adding more stuff like this. But honestly, I kind of like the idea of it. Let's go turn the lights on before we use it. Uh, just to make sure it's it's fine. So, lights on in here. There we go, hangar lights. Excellent. Go down into said hangar. And let's figure this out. So, this one's for like going that way. And also this way. Yeah, okay, that works. Uh, then we've got this one for moving it left and right. That just got stuck. I don't know why it got stuck there. There's literally nothing to get stuck on, but it works. Let's send it back that way and make sure it doesn't get stuck this time. It's getting stuck right there. That literally makes zero sense. That that makes absolutely no sense whatsoever. Uh, interesting. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know why that's the case, but there you go. So we can we can move it that way. We just can't move it this way. Weird. Anyway, uh, we can move it backwards. That's good. Winch up, that's working. Winch down, that is also working. So we should be able to pick things up um, and move them around the hangar. I, I like the idea of this. This is kind of cool. Kind of want it to look nicer than this, though. And we do need to figure out why it doesn't want to go that way. It doesn't make any sense to me why it doesn't want to, but there you go. So we need to figure that out. We also then need to build in one on that side. And I also want it to look nicer the way it attaches uh, with every little bit of this as well. Because at the minute, it's only attached there. Uh, and that's it, actually. That is actually it. So we're going to have to make that look better, but yeah, let's go for it. Oh, and the other thing is, I actually want to go ahead and delete the entire bottom of this thing, and I want to replace it with weight blocks. I know that might sound strange, but there is a reason. 
Uh, it's currently floating too high. That is literally my only reason. So what we're going to do is go from here. Uh, we need to figure out where the engine stuff is, because I believe that's on the bottom. Uh, we do need to figure that out, but all the way to this end. Uh, ah, that's not actually what I wanted. <laughs> that's not actually what I wanted. I wanted to delete this block all the way to the other side, not the other ones. Okay, right. This is going to take forever, but let's do it. Oh, it's so laggy. It's unreal. It's crazy how laggy this is. Yo, stop. Ah! Okay, incredibly laggy, but that's okay. So we need to delete this all the way to about here. So there we go. That's all getting deleted. It's just taking its time because it's so big, but there you go. This might even crash my computer. That would be, that'd be insane. But uh, it is getting deleted. There we go, excellent. And then we essentially just need to replace it with weight blocks. Uh, and you might be wondering why, uh, and I do have a reason. Um, because it currently doesn't weigh enough. <laughs> that, that's my reasoning. We do actually have to add more weight to one side as well, uh, because the bridge has gotten bigger. So now we need to add more weight to this side, but that's okay. So let's figure out how much weight we need to add by doing this. And as you guys can see, it's on this side of the line. So let's go to this side of the ship. And add a bunch more weight, shall we? Uh, we're actually going to add it on the side. Here we go. Okay, I don't know how I've just done that, but there you go. I added it wrong. <laughs> so from there up to about here. Excellent. And then we'll do it again, just to make sure we've got enough. And let's see if that is enough by doing this. And now it's on that side of the line. So now we delete some of this. We have to delete some of this. There we go. Delete some of this too. There we go. Good, and then have a little look. And it, I mean, it's more balanced than it was. We'll just delete two more lines of this, uh, and that should be good. So bring it all the way to this end. Delete those two. Let's have a little look at this. And yeah, I'd say that that's pretty good now. Excellent. All right, so the other thing is, uh, obviously, we need to actually paint all of this red now. So, oh, I did it wrong. I did it wrong. It's literally changing the entire ship to be red. That's not what we wanted. Uh, we want just the bottom bit to be red. So jug this bit, uh, and that should be good. It's going to weigh so much. It's going to be ridiculous. Also, I should have put it on the sides uh, as a little bit of armor, but never mind. It's okay. So engine room currently looks okay. I might make these engines look a little bit nicer in the future, but for now, we'll leave them as they are. Uh, what else have we got going on? What else have we got going on? So we still need to fix these guys. Let's do it. So I want to do it the same way I've done it on this side, if I can. So this goes down. Uh, onto there, just like so. Hopefully I'm doing this on that side too. Oh, it's not going to work, but that's fine. Uh, we're then going to add a block right there and a block right here, I believe. And then this goes from here over to the wall. Excellent. Uh, adds a little bit of detail. And then we're actually just going to go ahead and do this upwards. Yeah, onto uh, through the... Yeah, there we go. Delete these guys and that is... I mean, it's in. I think that fits. I think it works. And this side, obviously, it's just attached to there. But that's okay. So we'll actually just attach this guy uh, onto both of these. So right there like that. And then underside, we'll attach it like this. And I think that's fine. Yeah. Okay, good. Yeah. All right. And then every so often, we're actually just going to go ahead and attach it to the wall. So we're going to do something like this. Attach it upwards like so. Uh, actually, every one of these pillars, I'm going to do it on so that uh, it looks like it is well supported, which is fine. So there we go. Touch that onto there. We're going to continue. We're going to do it literally all the way down, which might be a bit ridiculous, but there you go. Uh, keep sending it. There we go. Keep sending it. Am I doing it from the bottom or the middle? From the bottom. Okay, good. Uh, keep it going. There we go. Uh, there, upwards. And that's the final one on this side. Excellent. So it is all attached to the wall now. It looks like it is attached anyway. Uh, and I'm happy with that. The reason why it's not going to the right, however... Uh, does any- oh, it's because it's not merged together, that's why. There you go, so we need to merge those together in order for that to work. Now it works, it'll be fine. I like this, this is good. We might add its own little lights on there as well, and I kind of want to change the color of the bar, uh, to be either yellow or, or something like that. So, we're gonna do this on there, we're also gonna do it on there as well. Alright, it's done it on both sides. And then the bar itself, we're gonna jug yellow. It's gonna be yellow. Is that weird? Alright, there we go. 
So it's going to be yellow on this side. We're then going to paint most of this uh, to make sure it is actually painted. There we go. Excellent. We're then going to jug the top end the same way. We're going to jug the bottom end the same way also. There we go. And then if I can, I want to paint the interior of this. But I don't think this ever changes. So there you go. All right. Excellent. Nice. We're then going to paint this across the top and the sides and the bottom. And we'll leave it just like that. I think that's fine. Actually, paint this yellow too. And maybe this one yellow. And yeah, that works. Nice. Okay, I'm well happy with this. This looks good. So let's go ahead and save this. Uh, we do know that it works now, so that's okay. We just need to do the exact same thing on the one on the other end of the ship. And hopefully that'll work too. I honestly think we should just grab this one. So we can, we can probably grab it from there all the way to here. There we go. Excellent. Grab all of this as well. And then go to this side and grab like all of this stuff too. There we go. Excellent. Uh, that seems fine to me. So we can just copy it. All right, we can take it to the other side of the ship. All right, anywhere over there works. That would be fine. Uh, so bring it in. We'll probably put it like somewhere central. That's okay. And we'll probably turn it around. There, like that. There we go. Paste this in. Uh, we're going to merge it in on both ends, obviously. So this one to there. We're going to merge in. That one's already merged. Okay, fantastic. And we're good. Yeah, so now we've got two cranes. That's excellent. I like this. All right, so because I want it to look a little bit nicer, we're going to go ahead and go from the wall, uh, like underneath one of these. I want to actually attach that directly onto here if I can. So we're going to go with two by ones. We're going to turn this around so it fits. And we're going to bring this down onto here. Yes. Okay, right. Excellent. We're going to do it again uh, on this side. And that'll be another bit of structure that works out for us. Yes. All right, bring this up. And there we go. Nice. Okay. Yeah, I think that works. I think that works. Okay, so in order for these cranes to actually work properly, realistically, we need like a little seat on them. I know that seems weird, but I do think we should add a little bit of a crane seat uh, underneath one of these cranes facing like inwards. I don't know how this is going to work or how this is going to look, but let's go ahead and try and build one in. Um, yeah, this is going to be weird. So we're going to bring it in from here. We're going to go across. There we go. We're going to bring this down, uh, just like so. That's fine. There we go. That does actually bring it down quite a bit, but that's okay. Uh, the bottom of it is going to be this color. Oh, I don't want to be doing it on both sides either, just one side. So disable that. There we go. Bring that across there. Delete all of this one because it's unnecessary. And we need to actually build in like a little seat. I, I don't know how this is supposed to look, but we're going to do this. Actually, no, we're not. How do I want this to look? I haven't thought about this very well. Uh, so that's going to go there like that. We're then going to just add in this like this. And then we're going to go to the yellow again. We're going to bring it upwards. Uh, I guess, actually, just kind of like this. There we go. And there we go. And then we're going to add a little bit of glass in order for this to work. So, uh, window. Is this going to work? I, I mean, I don't know, but I think so. So from there down to here, excellent. We're then going to whack these guys on as well, on this side and this side. And then probably on the roof we need some. I don't know how to do this. Sure, why not? So we're going to put this piece on top of there like so. We're going to do it on this side. I, if I can, I don't think I can. Oh, I don't think I should actually. Let's delete that again. There we go. Uh, maybe on the... I don't know. I genuinely don't know. Do we just want some windows like this and add like a seat inside that is able to control it? I have no idea. I think we'll go with that. There we go. Okay, excellent. Sure. That looks so weird, but that's fine. We'll then actually add a, a ladder uh, to the side of it. So like this. It goes down a little bit. We'll delete that and we'll delete this and we'll add some pipes and hopefully... Hopefully, this will look okay. I mean, it might. It might not. There you go. So, sure. I, I think I'm okay with that being a thing. Uh, so, we'll actually go ahead and add this to the other side as well, obviously. So, all of this, all of that. There we go. And all of the ladders also. There we go. Do I go down even further than that? I don't think so. No. Okay, so copy this. Kind of weird, but there you go. Take it to the other side. Let's go. 
And we're going to have some little... Uh... This is so weird. This is so weird. Alright, we're going to take it to the other side anyway. And we'll probably just attach it onto there just like this. There you go. Paste that in. Alright, merge this with that, I guess. Yeah, there we go. Uh, problem is, that's actually going to be able to hit these, which are our new additions. Which is annoying. So we're going to take these out instead. There you go. And delete all of this too. Yeah, why not? And that's fine. So it does mean that the, the, the planes that we have in here, their wings won't be able to go up that high. Or, I mean, actually, some of their wings actually did fall backwards. So maybe that's okay. We'll leave it as is uh, for now. But yeah, we need to delete this and this and this and this and this. There we go. Uh, I'm going to quickly attach it to the seats and label them. And then I'll get back with you in a second. Okay, I hope you guys are ready for this because obviously we've added the extra weight, uh, which means it might sink a little bit quicker. Uh, we've also actually maybe deleted things for the engine that are definitely necessary, so we might need to go back in there and fix that. In fact, the coolant definitely is uh, an issue here. But there you go, it's actually landed somewhat correctly. We need more weight in the front, but that's okay. Uh, it is closer to the waterline now than it should, uh, where it should be, which is good. Uh, we're going to go inside, and we're actually going to turn on the lights. Then we're going to go inside to here, because I have actually done a little bit of work on these. We can climb up the ladder and get inside of this. There we go. So, one is apparently right, which works. Two is left, which works. Three is away from you. Ah, uh, I need to change those ones around. Uh, but there you go, those work. And then winch up and down is five and six. Yeah, nice. Okay, that does actually work out quite nicely. So we can actually use these cranes. Um, that's brilliant. That is really, really nice. I don't know whether we should have built it like this, but we have. And uh, I think it'll work, to be honest. I like the idea of it. Am I getting stuck on something? Yeah. I'm going to delete the uh, the ladders. Uh, at least one of them. Yeah. Okay, that'll work. Um, good. Okay, we also need to delete that thing on the other side, because I haven't managed to do that. This stick right here. Um, and that'll be good. Yeah. Nice. Okay, so there are actually other things that we do need to add to this thing as well. Uh, someone actually suggested a towing vehicle, which does make sense, to be totally honest with you guys. Uh, a towing vehicle definitely makes sense. Also, the other thing is actually weapons elevators, uh, because weapons elevators uh, would be good for like bringing bombs up to the deck uh, to attach them onto the aircraft, etc. Uh, I do like the idea of that, but I think too much... Uh, th there might be too much physics going on with this thing, to be honest. Um, yeah, but <laughs> we'll see anyway. Uh, right, so let's go up to here again. Let's go ahead and uh, turn on the lights real quick. Da -da -da. Da -da 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 -do -do -do. There we go, excellent. Go down onto the inside and make sure both of these actually work. So inside we go. Uh, one is right, two is left, three is to you, four is away from you, excellent. And then five is down and six is up. Yes. Okay, that all actually works out quite nicely. In fact, very nicely. Uh, we should be able to take it all the way to the end as well. And there it goes. Kind of interesting. In fact, very interesting. I like it. So if there's anything we need to actually transport around inside of here, uh, we've now got a crane that can do it. Brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. Let's go check if this one works as well. Might as well just go ahead and jump inside of it and see. So we can jump up. We can get in. Press 1 for right. 2 for left. Three to you, four away from you, uh, five is down, and six is up. There we go. That's everything. I'm pleased with that. I'm very pleased with that. Very cool. I was suspecting that we were going to have an issue there, but look at how... Oh, no, we are going to have an issue, aren't we? Okay, so it turns out that the actual ladder on this one needs moving to the other side, but that is not that much of an issue, so I am okay with that. But for now, we'll just move it out of the way. So two to go left. It is slowly doing it. This is also trying to power itself down at the same time, which is why it's taking its time to go left. But uh, let's move out the way real quick. There we go. Now we can move back over. And uh, that's fine. Yeah. Okay. I'm real happy with this. This is cool. All right. So there we go. I think I'm actually going to leave these like this. Of course, I will actually move the ladder on the other one to the other side. But I think we'll leave these in here. Um, if... They actually become a problem at some point. We can remove them. There is not that much to them, to be fair. So we can move them. But uh, I like the idea of having them just in case there's something heavy in here that we need to move around. Um, it would be cool. Maybe even like big fuel tanks that we can move. 
that would be awesome. Uh, but for now, I want to say thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.